are not going to believe what we see in this video. We've been waiting more than 40 years for this to happen. Now, before I show you the magic of the new Microsoft 365, let's just add a data validation drop down list to this cell and then do a lookup formula to look up the price. So I'm going to select the cell where I want to add the drop down. Go up to the Data Ribbon tab, over to Data Tools, click Data Validation. Here's the Data Validation dialog box we've been using since the beginning of Excel time. I want to select a list. And down in Source, I'm going to select the product names, then click OK. And then from the drop down, I'm going to select Quad. So far, I don't see anything different. Now we'll use the amazing XLOOKUP function, which does exact match lookup by default. Lookup value, well, I'm looking up quad, comma. Where am I looking it up to try and get a match? This range right here, comma. What are the values I want to return to the cell? Well, these right here. When I close parentheses and hit Enter, XLOOKUP better return 43. 43. And sure enough, it does. But here's the magic. We have been wanting forever. I'm going to type M, and you got to be kidding me. We have a searchable data validation drop down list. And I can use my arrow key because I want Icarus. And bam, just like that, it looked it up. Type the letter Q. And the list only has the two quads, down arrow tab. And I get 96. Now it's going to get even better when I type the letter C. Sure, it gave me Carlota and Carlota doublers. But it's doing like an approximate match finding anything with the letter C. That is the amazing Microsoft 365 new and approved data validation drop down list. Hey, I want MTA COM tab. And there we get 43. All right, everyone should go out and get Microsoft 365 Excel because no other version has everything. That's it, Microsoft 365 Excel. All right, if you like that video, be sure to click that thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe because there's always lots more videos to come from Excel is Fun. All right, we'll see you next video.